Okay, here we go with the Mini Swift again now. Okay, note, when you build this, don't do what they say. Put the servos on top like I did on my big wing because I broke one of the servo gears and I didn't have one of those so I had to take out and put two of these TG9s in. These are what? Turner G 90s. Okay, 1800 milliamp and well, I have to retrim it, so I'm gonna have the camera on in case something exciting happens. Okay, turned on. Get up there in that good spot in the hat cam. So we're looking straight ahead. Oh man, oh man, I tell ya. I don't know what to give this other than to throw it high. Maybe go for a vertical climb so I can trim on the fly. There's no wind tonight. It's a very nice night. So here we go for lunch. Well, that wasn't good at all, guys. Holy moly. Well, I know what that was. I'll tell you right now. Reverse ailerons. But you know, that's got to say something for this airplane, I tell you. That took a half throttle dead nose in. Yeah, but you can see the nose is flexed. Broke my motor mount completely. Just snapped it off. I can glue that, fix that back up. That can be fixed. Wow, I'm impressed that the nose didn't break on this airplane. Okay. Well, wasn't that special? <laughs> ah. You can see how far the no dirt went. With no damage other than the broken motor mount. And that's maybe my design, but hey, we'll fix that and be in the air in seconds. Okay, sun's going down, but I gotta get a flight on this. And guess what? Control services were reversed. So, I gotta fix up. Get you guys up here in the hat cam. And, let's launch and trim this mini swift wing again. Now with the ailerons going the right way, the motor mount fixed, I can still smell the CA glue setting. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. And the ailerons is about trimmed sideways, perfect. Here we go. Yeah, it's flying good again. Oh, hang on. Maybe a hair much up trim. And a little bit, wow. I should put some exponential into this. We'll have to try that. I don't mind though. Having really sensitive throws. These are really sensitive now. Let's see what I can do if I do a roll. Okay, it's not bad. Let's go fast. Let's go fast. just cooks it but it also slows down very nice so there we go new servos now isn't that weird to think because I changed servos it reversed the ailerons on me because that's all I did was just change I didn't touch the radio I expected to do some trimming but I didn't expect the ailerons to be reversed because I changed the servos it's not weird
fly so nice these wings very much enjoy this maybe because it has so much power <laughs> and it scoots there quick uh oh there was a little bit of wind when I came out and there's no wind now and here in the north when you get no wind we then get something called mosquitoes out oh there's tons of bugs everywhere Such a fun plane to fly. Let's see if I can go a full throttle pass if I have. No. Three quarters. Oh, Paul. Very fun plane. I've been running pretty hard, haven't I? You know, but I almost get, if I check with my meter when I come down, I rarely make this 1800 milliamp go below 50% of battery in life left. I mean, holy. I think I could take it down to about 30%, 38 without hurting the battery. I've usually about 59, 60%. Here we go, full throttle. Haha. Okay. So much worth about fixes on this wing. You know, I just CA glued that plywood back together, put one brace in. That's all I did. And it's holding just fine, full throttle runs, everything. I'm coming in with no throttle now. I'm gonna come in and land because the sun is going down. Dusk will come and well, it's a nice sky, I don't think. His wings have such a small silhouette. Oh, see that landing? That's how you land a wing. Right beside where you took off. Yep. Right beside where you have to. Okay, so. No broken servos on landing this time, so if you build this kit, make sure you put the servos on the top. Just fill the holes on the bottom, they have pre cut. Or, I guess you could find something to cover this whole section here. Nice little cover. So you have to have your servo horn inside, though. So, you know. I just recommend putting them on the top of the wing. That's the best part. Now, that was a pretty long flight. And... The battery checker here. What does it say? See? Still with all that flying, I have 62% left in my battery. 62%. Is that quite a bit? It's only an 1800 milliamp. So, if it wasn't so many bugs out here, I would. I'd just throw it and go fly again. But there's so many bugs. I'm going to pack it up and head her home. Do some building. We'll see if we put this online. I might not, I might. We'll see. But that was a good crash. Good, um, I guess, to show how strong this kit is. It sure, sure went in hard. We'll have to see when we see the video. I haven't even looked yet. But oh well. Here we go. Special Swift 2 edition. 
the blue edition with the naked girl. Except I melted half her head off. Darn. Oh well. Very fun wing.